Well, this is going to be a real treat, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Dota Pit 2020. Uh, oh, here God. in Europe. This is like the no this is like Midas mode when teams started randoming. And there was yep. no there was no winning. It's like if you don't random and you lose, you're a try or, and you win, you're just a try hard. And if you then random and then you still lose to the it's like, oh well at least you know we random too. Now like what if you lose oh. a support tinker? Gracho, uh oh. He's gonna be blocked out. It's a good fissure from Zai, though he's got a lot of support now. Spirit. Pressing forward, they're going to put some damage onto Zai. Puppy snags the room, and no first blood drawn. Just a yeah. salve used by Spirit. More damage, Puppy comes back in, says, Hey guys, if you still want to fight, I'm here. And Spirit going to call that bluff. The blind from Yapsor, is it going to save Puppy? No, that's a first blood for Yamich. That was nice, the re-goose back in. Malik's been really good at hitting him with these like long range and constant swashbuckles. He's trying to keep him Never. low. Yeah, he's a he's ahead of the life stealer still, so it's working out okay. And they get the stomp, but unfortunately miss the torrent. Yeah, and he should so have Malik, believe, dude. Yep, almost able to survive, but the right clicks will be there. And now Yamich gonna be on the run, still only level one, as the centaur goes down. That was so, a really weird swashbuckle. And Black now Misha, the other Isha, if you will, down Say that, and Zai is currently on his way to building a Necro, so. And they're going to move in onto Yapsor. Draccio gets off the Rage, but he's actually going to take a decent amount of damage here. Yapsor's going to turn and throw some auto attacks, gets blocked out by the Fissure, and they take him to school, dude. They bought him a notebook, they sat him down and said, Son, this is what happens when you cross this line. And you know it's through the blind. And then when he starts running back like that, like if there was mana on Zai, I'm pretty sure Drashio would have died. In fact, he might be close. dead right now. Oh. Oh, all right. He has no nope. fairy fire. <laughs> Checking in on mid. Dead even. Although Ergon is about to hit level six. Let's take a look at net worth and see where they're at. Yapsor? And the Void Spirit is ahead. So, oh, they're going to find Yapsor down bottom. Zai also likely to go down here. Does get the counter kill onto Misha, so that feels good. But a two for one. Draccio the big winner. Does he go for and the bounty get both bounties? He's going for it. Dare I say, what a time to be alive. It's the life of Zai, I guess. Double yeah. Down I, mean, it, I guess it is just that, that value item. Matu, Ergon again, battling it out. Double damage on the AM. He is going to go for this. Blinks up to the high ground, forces the TP. Now going to be on the run. He's be a little careful here, but gets the mana oh, void. And now he's going to pop damage. He blinks forward and finds it. Might die to the tower. Oh, yes, he will. Still very much worth. Yeah, I wasn't sure if he wanted to. I, yeah, I talk about how, like, I feel like a techie's rework should include, like, an artillery ability where, like, he can still help in team fights from, like, far away or something. That's pretty much the support tanker. He's just, like, 2,500 range. Look, the Necro is chasing Misha, and he's just going to die because of it. <laughs> yep, and they did kill Puppy up top. Malik with the Rolling Thunder, able to chase him down. But yeah, absolutely. From like a support perspective, the range is ridiculous, and his burst damage is crazy with this build. Yeah, it's twice the distance of your typical aura, or even a little bit further. Twenty five hundred. It doesn't even show a box when you highlight it. It's so big. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Wow, that's. <laughs> You're right. Uh, nice, nice recapture from Aragon though to get some XP for the Radiant team. Draccio maybe in trouble as he presses forward, but now blocked out. Ergon's here. Draccio's still going to fall. Might get this kill on Yapsor. Matu's here, though. White though. Matu ready to save his friend. Ice Path does clip him, though. And Misha gets the kill. He's also going to pay with his life, though. And the roaming anti-mage will get another one up on the scoreboard here. They who live by the wand shall die. Matu having a field day. I think it was just a state of the game situation, you know? Right. So he was in lane doing burst, and now that he's mid, he's like, okay, I I'm going to farm a little. We're not just rolling the same lane. I guess they're going to trade. Down bottom, Zai will fall. I trade, I was thinking, uh, lanes on the side of Secret. Uh, now they'll go in on the Puppy, and Ench falls. That's a set of kills for Spirit. Very nice. And without the Battle Fury, and that'll kick in before too long, probably another minute or two. Nature I tennis. yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know where you go from here, man. It just looks really bad. They can keep killing like Poppy and Zai. Oh, they can't kill. Well, we'll see. They're gonna try to kill Poppy. Ergon will get him, but Nisha also comes in with a good combo that'll finish off Yamich. 
And Matu's here. Say goodbye to your mana, Ergon. Does get off a nice taunt. Meanwhile, on the other side, Anisha tanking the whole team, just walking on the macro pyre. The apps are in the back throwing missiles. Big oh, Nails will lose the Kunkka. Anti Mage, though, drops the mana void, gets Ergon low. He'll go down. Dunk from Zai. Only connects on two, but might set up for more out of the Anti Mage. Malik gets a disarm. Drachio comes in. Matsu blinks defensively. Now Zai going to be on the run. Secret trying to get out. And I think Zai going to be left behind. Smart money. Oh, oh nice stun. But no, Shadow Realm's got him. That frost armor almost saved him, the ice armor. <laughs> and more rockets. That'll get Malik. They've got a ward down. Support Tinker. Like, you, you just have no op. You can't push anything. Like, Tinker, Kunkka, Earthshaker, how are you ever going to push a tier 2 tower? They have such good defense when you're in small proximity. We'll see a fight here in the jungle. Terrorize, interrupted. Nice fissure. Yamich just going to recast it. But not going to survive. Yapsor in the back just laying in the missiles. Going to be out of mana now, but heading back to the well. Dunk solo on the Drachio. Dude, they are handling this life stealer so well. It's like he doesn't have rage. Yeah, he's like irrelevant this game. <laughs> like, it's not just that, that they're killing him. The stun lock from Secret is so impressive. They just comboed him full to zero. He has an armlet. I mean, it's not like this life stealer went for some greedy build. He just can't do anything. We're gone in on Nisha. No boat. Zai, though, with a fissure. I think Nisha's a goner. And yeah, Secret not going to go for this. It's hard to get the, the plus one right now without the blink dagger done on Malik and the middle not to have a Yules when you have a Jakiro and a Void Spirit. Like they can set up such a great CC chain. Here we go. In onto the AM. This is the CC chain we're talking about, but they're going to be short on damage. That was the beginning of it, but you needed a little bit more. Now the rest of Spirit ready to rumble. Oh, that Fisher. He'll come in mid. Zai breaks it up. You know, on the other side, Puppy caught by Ergon. And okay, they do get him. Yaps are on the other side, finished off by Malak. It will cost Malak his life. Oh, he's feared on the AM. They can get him. Coming in for the more. The AM could fall. Wait, the burn down. Fire. <laughs> He'll burn from the macro pyre. The buff. Two seconds of sticky. He did 100 damage <laughs> to the AM. That's all he needed. Now Nisha, he's going to get dove. Secret about to lose three. Nisha very tanky, but Zai though? Okay, is this the turn? They used the glyph to get the extra damage out of the tower, and Ergon will chase down the Kunkka and finish him off. There's two Tinker Wards though. That is a Radiant Tinker Ward, so they see Zai lurking. They are coming for this kill on Zai. Oh. Not much the Shaker can do here. He does have an Echo, but he is not going to waste it. Your time and Zai with the Discipline. They're going to watch this life to the TPO. Bots is going to go in on this Dark Willow. Oh, hey, Void Spirit. There's the Yules. They run. Anti-Mage, good at closing gaps. Haunted. Into a Bramble. Nice sidesteps. Now the Blink up. Finds Ergon. Pops the Mana Void. <laughs> Damage will TP out. Nisha can't get the torrent in time. Meanwhile, Puppy's just toying with him over here, waiting for his allies to show up. Yep, now the rockets. Tetris may be in He's trouble. He's still attacking Tachio. Puppy. He's like, maybe. He actually can't kill him. Now he just hops inside of Misha, like, come on, man, let's get the hell out of here. Misha dies, of course. Ergon buys back. Does finish Your off call. Yapsor in the back line with the help of Malik. A long, drawn-out fight. Now a buyback from the Shakiro. A great terrorize. Keeps Malik alive. Ergon looking to clean up Misha. But that Kunkka is rather tanky. He will go down. Matu finally uses the BKB. And he wants this dieback on Ergon. Going to be tough without the mana pool. Now turns on to Yamich. He can't finish off these kills. But Spirit have five alive. With the buyback, Secret a bit overwhelmed. It will be repelled. But I think they won this Radiant's fight in terms of economics. Yeah. Uh, Actually, no. Price uh, worth of net worth. Yep. If you combine the Life Stealer and Void Spirit, you've got one Anti Mage. 
And here we go. Puppy put up in the Yules. Gets the counter ward. Matu's here. This is an odd fight for Spirit. They don't have the Void Spirit. And all five of Secret are here. They're Ooh. not going to take this one. Malak and Yamich pop. And Draccio, no option. Brought down as a triple is secured for the Matumba Man. Uh oh, they block out the Jakiro. Going to be one more. I don't know why Spirit forced that, Trent. It was a 4v5. Yeah, but they, they're not sure what the numbers are. They think maybe they're back farming. They think... Man, I know we said they make games look easy, but damn, dude. They got to support Tinker. 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 People aren't even playing him as a core. I had to double check Zai's items. They didn't have a crit for a second there. So it's a 700 damage <laughs> Jan totem. No, he's just a core shaker. Oh, whoa. That's a big dunk. Zai sets it up on three. Nice and fast from Draccio, but I don't think it's going to take okay, the scale to say. get the bash as he TPs <laughs> out or tries to. Uh, they called GG. And, and there was yeah. no way he was going to have that TP, but it got frighteningly close. Victory. Yeah. GG. I can't believe that game lasted 30 minutes. I, I, I guess Spirit mean, did it. put up a, a decent decent something, but... That does not look good. That's the pain. That was... Uh, that was a, a proper slaughter.